Hey guys, Jacob here. Uh, I'm in my office at Take Part Live getting ready for the show tonight. Uh, just wanted to say sorry that I didn't upload a video this past weekend because I was in New York um, for New York Fashion Week. My wife uh, was opening a store for her company, so I got to go and celebrate that with her. It was really cool. Um, I want to answer your questions uh, that you left me last week. Um, but before I do that, I want to, uh, maybe I'll show you around my office real quick. Um, I made a video before that sort of shows you around behind the scenes at Take Part Live here at CBS Television City, which is such a legendary uh, broadcast center. Craig Ferguson films here, Price is Right films here, Bill Maher films here, a bunch of soap operas film here, Dancing with the Stars, yada, yada, yada. But check out this video, um, and uh, you will get to see the tour a little bit, at least, um, behind the scenes here. So this is my, my little tiny office. Um, I've got my little TV and all my books. Um, I got my Valentine, Olivetti Valentine Italian typewriter that my dad gave me. A little book, Dream Team, uh, Haikus, comic book uh, that I got in my neighborhood in Silver Lake. Um, on my desk here is my Vin Scully bobblehead. Hey, legendary Dodgers broadcaster. Lifetime supply of Lifesavers. Uh, and a picture of my wife and Abraham Lincoln and a bottle of old sober off that my friends at HuffPost Live gave me uh, on my last day there. Um, and also this picture of us that I like to look at all the time. So, oh, and that's uh, Cliff Paul, Chris Paul's doppelganger, my favorite player, Los Angeles Clippers. Um, there we have a sign that says, sorry, we're closed for voting. Uh, voting is important to me, and that's for my Why Tuesday campaign. I, we did a collaboration with Good Magazine back in the day. Here's my secret closet where I make espresso um, before the show. All right, enough of that. Um, Coco Pop, one, two, three, four, five, six says, what would you do with no internet? Uh, I don't know, I'm addicted to the internet. It's sort of bad, um, but what I do wanna say about that is that's why it's important we have net neutrality. Um, I think tomorrow is the beginning of the campaign because the FCC is gonna be deciding on net neutrality, I think on the 15th. We're talking about it actually tonight on Take Part Live. I'm ch I've changed my avatar if you go onto my Twitter. Um, to this little thing uh, that, uh, that is a campaign to encourage net neutrality. Right now, companies can have a fast lane on the internet, which means there will be slower internet for some or the rest of us, and uh, that's just not cool. Ian David says or asks, thoughts on Joan Rivers passing? Uh, it's terribly sad. Um, Joan Rivers, incredible comedian, um, hysterical. I was cracking up. We had a video of her on YouTube Nation the other day. So quick-witted, so hysterical, so on the ball, um, and really so trailblazing um, for so many, not just women comedians, but comedians in terms of the type of humor she did. Um, she will be very, very missed. Fee, Willi Fee Willio asks, isn't one person's terrorist another person's freedom fighter? I think this is a really good question and a really good point. And I think one of the most important lessons I learned in college is you got to think about things from other people's vantage points. And... The point of view um, that you come from is not the point of view necessarily that other people are coming from, and that's okay. Um, Rodrigo Arturo Ramirez Reyes says, Sup, Jacob, what is a video curator? Uh, at YouTube Nation, we have a team of video, video curators led by the one and only Ernest from Stump Ernest fame, and our curators um, are the lead team of people that pour through videos every single day uh, that end up going on the show. Um, sometimes I'll pitch videos to them, um, but it's literally their full-time job. What a cool job to be able to watch videos, um, keep an eye on everything that's going on, on the internet, the stuff that everybody's talking about, the stuff that nobody's ever seen, um, and so that we can bring them to you each and every day. Um, Unboxing John, do you have any children or childlike persons in your life? The only childlike person in my life is me, Unboxing John. Next one, Rocky Barrett, and what religion are you? <laughs> um, I'm Jewish. I'm not super religious but I like a good turkey sandwich at a deli. All right, guys, I think that's it. Leave more questions for next week. I'll answer them this weekend. Uh, thanks a lot. See you later. Bye.